I don't know what, why, guys, but I was led to read you guys the song from the Beastie Boys called High Plains Drifter. And I don't know why, but it's been in the back of my head for months now regarding the Shanann Watts, where Chris Watts buried his wife, his pregnant wife, 15 week pregnant wife, Shanann, in a shallow ditch and then took his two beautiful little daughters, Cece, Celeste, that just turned three, and Bella, and put them each in separate oil battery tanks that is like the sludge, the most disgusting part of the oil and the fumes can instantly kill you. So anyway, I was led to read the lyrics of the song for some reason. So let's break it down and see what it has to say. I used to like the song years ago, I guess. And then I don't know all the lyrics, so let's see what it says. Okay, so it's High Plains Drifter by the Beastie Boys, and it goes, Because I'm the High Plains Drifter, and I'm the Drifter, the High Plains Drifter. And I'm the Drifter, they can't catch me, they're never gonna find me. They're never gonna know that I'm the High Plains Drifter. Pulled over to the river to take a rest. Pulled out a pair of pliers, pulled a bullet out of my chest. Fear and loathing across the country, listening to my eight track. I reached behind the seat and snatched a cool from the pack. I'm a long distance from my girl and I'm talking on the cellular. She said that she was sorry and I said, yeah, the hell you were. Check the rear view, check the rear view mirror, check the gold tooth display, check the odometer, and I was on my way, because I'm the high plains drifter, the best that you can get, a strap shop lifter, a pirate on cassette, bust a Travis Bickle when I feel them getting pushed, don't step to me, because you should be getting mushed, I'm doing 120 Plowing over mailboxes, radar detector to tell me where the cops is. Hmm. Spend another night at the Motel 6. It's $5 extra to get the porno flicks. And then I concoct a black and tan in my brandy snifter. I'm a kleptomac Kmart shoplifter. Kmart shoplifter. I'm a kleptomaniac, Kmart shoplifter. Cash flow getting low, so I had to pull a job. I found a nice place to visit, but a better place to rob. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I left my car outside and the engine still revving, taking care of business at the 7-Eleven. And then I went inside to make my withdrawal. I saw what he had, but I had to take it all. Wow. I saw what he had. Why do I think of him seeing Shanann Watts before they started dating her mansion house? I saw what he had, but I had to take it all. Knucklehead Deli tried to jit me off the price. So I clocked him on the turban with a bag of ice. Cause I'm Molello like Yolello, cool like lemonade. Why did I just think of Chris Watts walking in that freaking place in the morning to get a breakfast sandwich after he just did all that to his wife and two beautiful daughters? Wow. Wow. Okay. Okay, that's crazy. I made my getaway, then I thought that I had it made. I feel like Steve McQueen, a, f a former movie star, looked in the rear view, viewer, seen the police car. Valentine Quartz, oh, with the puzzle on the cap. What's Valentine Quartz? That's weird. Nikki Kessinger with the crystals, right? Valentine Quartz with the puzzle on the cap. I couldn't help to notice I was caught in a speed trap. Dirty Mary, Crazy Larry on the run from Dirty Harry. Oh my God, 
Wow, so who's that? Dirty Mary, I guess, would be a Nikki Kessinger. Crazy Larry would be Jim. And Dirty Harry, I guess, would be Chris Watts. Is that who's playing out in this song, guys? Okay. Stash, stash the cash in the dash. But my gun I did carry. I'm seeing blue and red flashing deep in the night. I got my alibi straight. And I pulled over to the right. The cop knocked on my window and said, Boy, what is the fire? You got a mailbox on your bumper and a bald front tire. Out of the car, long hair. Your goose is cooked. Read me my rights, fingerprint and booked. Fingerprinted and booked. Wow. I'm sorry I'm doing the voices. I'm used to... <laughs> I used to always go in and read to my son's class and they loved it. Anywho. Verse 3. Making like a DT, driving a grand fury. Wherever I hang my hats, my home, and my past is kind of blurry. <laughs> Every dog will have his day. Mine will be in front of jury. High plains drifter, you know that I'm never in a hurry. Read me my rights as if I didn't know this. Oh, wow. Threw me in the tank with a drunk called Otis. With his five o'clock shadow, he smelled of three day old beer my man turned to me and said why are you here i said i'm charming i'm dashing i'm rental car bashing <laughs> why did i just picture chris watts pictures when he got <laughs> when he got sentenced and like all the beautiful pictures of like you know like the rusex crying perfectly and like i don't know it just <laughs> So commercialized this whole thing is so crazy i don't even know anymore okay you ready <laughs> ah, i said i'm charming i'm dashing i'm rental car bashing i'm phony paper passing at nick's check cashing nick's oh my god like nikki's check cashing i'm phony paper passing at nikki k's check cashing I went before the judge. He sent me to the Brooklyn House of D. He said, you behave or we'll throw away the key. Houdini'd out the cuffs, kicked the screw in the knee. I took the bailiff's wallet and went straight to OTB. I had a good feeling. Easy come, easy go. I bet on one horse to win and your mother to show. And sure enough, that nag came in. Brought my ticket to the window and collected my win. And then I broke into my new car with a wire coat hanger. Hot wired, hot wheeled, and Susie is a headbanger. Is that Nikki is a headbanger? And why did I just picture her texting him? Look up the battery lyrics. That's not even a good song. Anyway, battery. Yeah, so what do you guys think? That's crazy. What is Ballantine Quartz? Okay, I think it's beer or whatever this is. It looks like a shuriken. Anyway, that was High Plains Drifter by the Beastie Boys from the album Paul's Boutique. And it kept going through my head. That's all I kept thinking for the past few months. So I figured I'd go over the lyrics with you. Do you guys think the lyrics conflate to the dunes and the high plains, the great sand dunes, San De Cristo mountain range? Leave your thoughts below. Oh, thanks for walking with me, guys. And also, if you like this, like it, leave a comment, make sure to subscribe. And hit the notification key so you're alerted when we post our next video. And I'll be back soon with another video. Thanks for walking with me. Be back soon.